who else, guys, could could he have? Let's say we wanted Wes Houlihan to come on at half time. McGeady came on. Like who else could have come on in a in a position where we're taking mile or off? No, well McGeady shouldn't have come on. Well, who, who should have come on instead of McGeady? Well, nobody. Or you could put Long on instead of okay. Murphy. But what we're saying is you shouldn't. Go all in. Didi's absolutely right. The first 20, 25 minutes, you 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 get the, you play yourself back into the game. You don't give anything away. You hope hopefully you get something with Houlihan well, Liam, creating somebody. Myler is the anchor midfield player. To Leave Myler on. Leave Myler on. Don't bring McGeady. Don't bring yeah, McGeady on. No, and, okay. and, and put that's Wes what I mean. He, he he went all in with his gamble, with his money. He went. I'm I'm, I'm back in the and, and 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 it backfired. And there's the thing because you know he has been accused of being at times too pragmatic too conservative and he goes as you say all in the well, season especially with a player like Ericsson in their team you well, know why did that happen then well it's a, it's a mistake made by uh, the manager it's just a mistake and David Myler had done nothing to deserve to come off you need an anchor in that area where Ericsson operates and Myler was on the bench for most of the campaign he then appeared in the team as captain against Moldova. Mm. I think the third goal. I think their third goal shows vividly well, yeah. what yeah. we're yeah. talking here it is, about. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I, I take your points. it. Yeah. Now there, at this stage, they're a goal in front. Remember, we were a goal in front. But well, watch what they do with the ball. They stroke it around and they make us work like dogs. And they pull us around the park. And this is where the holes appear. There's Ericsson on the ball, and that's in the back of the net. Now, David Myler would have been occupying a, that screening holes in front of the back four. There's no one in front of the back four. They're outnumbered three to one, and it's in the back of the net. That's what they did when they were ahead, and that's what we should have been doing when we were one ahead. But the player who could do it is Wes Hulan, who could lead the orchestra. And you need somebody like that. Yeah, and this is 62 minutes. We saw a game here against Austria where they've been outplayed for 80 minutes. Walters gets the equaliser. Mm. And in the last minute, they could or should have won it with a, with a head off Duffy, which was disallowed. So even in the last five, ten minutes, if it's 2 1, you still got a chance because you score a goal of a set piece. And after 62 minutes, uh, the tie is over. And, and this is where, where I think they, the management and the players and the team, they let themselves down. Um, because this is a situation, one thing I'm mad about this team and about the whole setup, they ha don't show any mental weaknesses. I can, uh, if they haven't got the technical ability to pass mm. the ball, not a problem. You've got to play to their strength. But what they didn't do is mental, uh, show mental weakness or, or make mental mistakes. And this, I felt, was, a, was, um, yeah, was just a, a, a basic mental mistake where they tried to chase something far too early. Uh, with half an hour to go, you need two goals. You know, we've seen the, the most yeah. outrageous things on, on, on football pitches. So uh, this was not a time at half time to really gamble and, 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 and go all in. All right, it, guys. Are oh, you sorry? No, go on. Just make your point. We're going to go for a break. Go ahead. No, go for a break. All right. Are you sure? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hold those thoughts. Okay. We keep you waiting for that. It's going to be good. No pressure, Liam. <laughs>